Are you part of the electoral electoral for CIT? Yeah, my proposed my candidate. For the most of general secretary cap for the year 2016-17, I have been involved in various activities at IIT Delhi, and I would first like to talk about my trip. Next, I will present my five-point agenda in order to make the student experience at IIT Delhi a better one. I will answer all queries at the end. I am currently pursuing my dual degree as sales rep in the engineering department, and I have served as UG CAC rep last year. I have worked in civil engineering society in the capacity of deputy general secretary and organized workshops pertaining to internships. Come forward, come forward, come forward. Yeah. 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 I have worked in civil engineering society in the capacity of deputy general secretary and organized workshops pertaining to internships and projects. I have been closely associated with the social service activities of NSS IIT Delhi. As a part of the NSS, I have organized blood pressure camps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Health collection. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
when we tend to do research on the perspective of publishing papers and filing patent, I believe it is time to take this one step forward from patent to product stage. I propose to have in collaboration with alumni cell and EDC seed funding opportunities focused on engineering entrepreneurship. This can lead to a blend of technology and startup spirit to build core engineering startups. Now I would like to talk about future opportunities. As you all know that there is a discrepancy in job opportunities between core engineering and non-core jobs in IIT. We also see lack of PG representation in nucleus team of TNP cell. We will try to bring a balance on in this UG and PG representation. Being an engineer, we must have a proper knowledge about the procedure and formats of research paper publishing, the patent submission and greater applying in foreign universities. For this, we need workshops, seminars and if possible, a research community club. And now coming to improving existing core performing divisions, we know about the co-curricular bodies that are underperforming despite a lot of hard work being put in by the students. Involving more PG students based upon their research areas will be advantageous for everyone. The, the circular for such club will be sent out with a targeted approach and clubs will be encouraged to interact and involve the PG, PIT and the MTech students. Coming to the departmental societies, the constitution, the current team and the tentative calendar will be made available of, to everyone on the website. And now finally coming to Chris. One minute. There's tremendous scope for improvement in Chris. The major issue is PG involvement. And really, I can tell you, I was asked in interest, I'm open to your views how we can improve this. Because as you know, the PG guys have a much more experience of organizing guest lectures and other stuff. Because they are much more into the technical side. So if we can involve them, we can definitely improve the quality of Chris. Now, finally, I think there should be certification for recognizing efforts of all of you. All the active members of CAC must be certified for their hard work. Looking back, I think one of my biggest strengths is in dealing with people incorporating diverse views and strong institutions. I am confident that these will hold me in a good stead as a captain, General Secretary. Thank you. May the best candidate win. The second part contains on what vision I have for the So in the starting, what I want to do is that the IIT associates for the last two years. Initially, I was representative for the board and then I was a pre-publication agency of the board. I have given my 100% during my whole tenure and everyone is aware of the task. Whatever I have done, I have just done because I, have, I want the board to excel and I want the board to be in new level. As a board, thing, in each and every possible way, I want to help the students of IDS. That's why I have done all the activities last year. So, uh, during my tenure as a representative, I have been organizing many camps and workshops and
potential degree requirement. So I think that's indeed a very good job. Uh, I will also associate it with the mentorship committee throughout the major stage in process and throughout the major mentoring process. Apart from that, I have been handling uh, many events in Sriracha. Yeah, I have been managing many events. I have been managing a lot of events on the week. And I have ensured that each and every event goes through 100% success and it was a success. For me, the board, the Sriracha, the students get to know about it and they should know that whenever, what I want is that First thing, whenever a student, or okay, whenever any student, a PC student, a MSC student, whenever he wants anything, the PC student should be a hub for them. Maybe in order to So now, turning on to my vision. I propose that I want to make a new PC student committee. Apart from the new PC student committee, which will take students with, with a non PC student rep and from all years and from PC backgrounds as well. Because I want to increase the PC student interaction between us because uh, it will help in a very, very, uh, very, very productive. So, how do the increase centers really come about the PSU? How? Through orientation, right? So, I propose that we should cover PC orientation as well because uh, that's why, and the, that's why this committee will help us because in that way we have a large number of people supporting us so that we can cover PC orientation and PC orientation to both of us. And since the Esperanza also, we can start early management and early, early publicity of the event by the use of this committee. Uh, apart from that, more and more initiatives will be taken and it's going to stimulate the outreach and scope of these the groups and uh, it, they are more and more involvement of people are there taking place in the city. So basically what I am doing with this, uh, with this committee is I am actually increasing the PSU uh, team size without actually increasing. So use uh, 20 kids are the low limit, not it. So apart from that, I want to uh, ensure that this proper documentation of the work being done by multiple newsletters. Everyone says multiple newsletters, multiple newsletters, but I ensure that they are, there are multiple newsletters. And for the rest, this is added incentive for them to work. I will ensure that uh, their recognition, whatever they need to be included, that is being mentioned by the PSL2 Facebook page as well and the newsletter. And that too regularly into the PSL2 Facebook page. And apart from that, I, I also raised the point of anonymous feedback to the representatives on the progress and productivity of the team members and also the, uh, their secretaries and their general secretaries. Apart from that, I also want to take the feedback from first year students to so have to analyze what exactly they want from us, what exactly problems they are facing and also in general a general feedback from everyone so as to what kind of camps, workshops they want us to conduct so as to make it uh, so as to do what we are supposed to do. Students get there. Apart from that, coming on to the financial committee, how I propose to increase the budget is that I want uh, that uh, uh, humanity more important to be given to following money because it actually adds up to the budget of the PS2 due to which we provide loans and grants. So that is right. The another thing is that I want that proper publicity of the PS2 grants and loans should be done for the target audience. Not for everyone, not so that everyone can take advantage of the PS2 giving loans. For targeted audience, and that is why we have this year we started raising the student registration and registration program so that we can get to know about the students who are from uh, big backgrounds so we can use basically for this. So, another thing is that I want to collaborate with AIT so as to we can ensure a larger number of uh, funds being given to us by the AIT and alumni so that we can provide more and more notes to the needy students as well. So, uh, coming on to student teacher interaction master that is six D. So this year number of uh, professors visiting six was very low. So I what I wanted was that I wanted to collaborate with CAP so that we can uh, get in touch with the of each and every department and that is why we can uh, we can increase our outreach to the student of the professors as well by each uh, by focusing at one department at work and we can collaborate with CAP for that. Other important thing is I have to say each faculty has provide, been providing 100 rupees per student per semester and the many are not aware of this. So what we can do is we can properly collect this amount and we can organize at least one industrial trip per year, at least one industrial trip. For example, for a student they have six courses. So we can take 600 rupees per student uh, for some professors, 100, 100 rupees. So and we can organize the industrial trip along with the faculty of that department. So this will help to break the ice, actually break the ice. And, the students. and also, window games should be increased 
So that uh, the similarity is as far we were able to improve the board game. Good afternoon everyone, my name is Rishab Sandi and I'm the Regional Secretary and I will be presenting my statement of purpose for the post of General Secretary BRCA. So I would like to start off by telling you guys what BRCA has given to me. Right? So I've been here as first side of the I've been a performer, I've been a rep, I've been a secretary. I've been a lot of things from things like you know calling people to come out, practice for practice for to organizing events, you know, ha, judges ki score sheet, judges ki hospitality, to forming policies, like, you know, having music societies. And the most important thing, what I learned from my second year was to build a team. Okay? I've learned a lot. And you know what I want to do as, if I'm elected as the general secretary of BRCA, I want to give back to the institute. That's what I want to do. Okay, and why, what, for, for me, BRCA is an eight independent club. Like Nikhil said, rightly, we integrated as a whole. We have the capability to impact a huge number of people, right? By impact, let me come to Rendezvous, one of the biggest festivals in India, right? So, uh, in Rendezvous, so we have, um, oh, sorry, yeah. In Rendezvous, we have a lot of events, yeah, we have a lot of people working, but last time we had a few, few issues, like, say, security was a problem, and um, other issues, like, so hospitality, the team wasn't getting food, right? So we can get rid of these, but these are, like, you know, small addressable issues. The main issue which I felt which we had was Rendezvous, was team work. You know, I, I thought that I was, like, you know, some people thought, yeah, 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 yeah. but some people were just working, yeah, I want to work for the sake of it because I've been given this post, so now I have to work. 
when I get become the general secretary, I will have rendezvous so that everyone works with passion. So that everyone works ki haan yaar ye mera rendezvous hai. Everyone works with the feeling of belongingness ki this is mine. You know and when you work like that, when you work with, the, with, with like you know as a team with a common goal, the, the event goes from pure to pure. That's what we want to be about. And I think this was quite visible in the music, in the last few music club events as compared to the first two events, right? So besides that, like you know I want to talk about something as simple, something like you know giving a meaning to things. That's like you know perspective. For example, I'm conducting an event. I can look at it. Ah, yeah, we go. Sal, we three event. Karan hai. Or my event. Karan. That's one way of looking at it. But the way I look at it is, I will say, ah, we go. One event. Karan hai. But that event has an impact. What is the impact? The impact is that I am giving so many people an opportunity to enhance their personality. How? We all come from so many different backgrounds. How many of the people in our school lives do we get a chance to perform? Do we get a chance, to, you know, to show our talent? We don't. What does BRC give us? It gives us an opportunity to perform. It gives us an opportunity, you know. That's a purpose. And if I have a purpose for an event, my passion goes from here to here. That's the kind of culture I want to inculcate in BRC. That's what I want. I want everyone to feel that you know, yeah, I am doing something with a purpose, and I'm not just doing something for the sake of it. Now, I would like to talk about you know some some things like you know uh, within the campus we can have regularization of informal events. Like we have Friday nights, but you know it can be hard to have something like that regularly. It can be too much pressure on the club. Why not have all clubs be a part of it? Why not have a movie screening like Sunset has already organized, and have maybe a slam poetry and movie uh, and dance, stand-up comedy. There's so many things, you know. Why not create an atmosphere where everyone has the opportunity, a medium. Think about like that. You know, I'm conscious. Hai. I'm conscious. Nahi honge, hai. We will perform. Okay. Besides this, I would like to say that we can add more meanings to our events. For a simple event like Mayfair. Where we added ethnic day, the meaning changed from you know having it be a event where we stay, do classical music to having an event where we celebrate the Indian cultural heritage, right? How many more people could relate to it just because of that small addition? You know things like these, things that add a personal touch to our event. You know these personal touches make us relatable to like so many more things. Besides this, in inter college, I would like to talk about like you know I would like to propose an inter IIT cultural meet. You know we have a sports team. Why not have a cultural meet? In fact, I know that Avad last year it was passed in the IIT Bombay SAC, and Avad has given his consent. And um, currently, uh, I had a word with Professor Adi Mishra as well, so we can we are definitely going towards it. Besides this, you know, I would like to make a point about accountability. I would like all of us to take a stand for something as simple as an election. Why do we want to feel like you know? Why why shouldn't we be responsible for our own action? Why should we at the end of it feel that my hostel was responsible for not electing me or my hostel was responsible for something? We should be responsible. We should be accountable. That's the culture I want to inculcate in RCA. <laughs> Besides this, I want to tell you all that I will always be very approachable. I will always be very hardworking. In fact, I've been working for Rendezvous for more than a month, and I will talk with an international artist, which will make Rendezvous bigger than we have ever had. And I, I would just like to end. Uh, I would just like to end by saying that um, if you guys choose me, I will make sure that I will put in my best effort, all my hard work. I will put in everything that I have to inculcate a culture where everyone feels together, where everyone feels like, like I said, a family. Yeah. So thank you.